Hi, this is Dan Stein, and this is my overview of what was accomplished and what I've learned in EDU 9801 research methods when, with Dr. Sarah and Dr. Tatum. This course was split, and so I was privileged to see two learning uh, teaching styles as well as covering an immense amount of contact, content. Uh, here's a quote that I enjoyed. Uh, you can force commitment. You cannot force commitment. What you can do, you nudge a little here, inspire a little there, and provide a role model. Your primary influence is the environment you create. And these professors certainly did that. Uh, in the course, we learned uh, to define terms, draft research questions, which mine was on the learning uh, response document. It has since changed. Uh, understand what to develop a conceptual rationale, uh, learn what a precy is, uh, review other kinds of work done by others, uh, and we had textbooks. Of note, uh, I wanted to share this with you. There's a new feature at Barnes & Noble that allows previews. It's not with all books yet, but it's certainly with a lot. And if you click on uh, this video, you'll see that it discusses uh, survey research method, which is here, and actually has samples uh, of the two of the chapters that were assigned. Uh, three, five, and six were assigned from this book. Links also appear to the other uh, textbooks that we've done. Uh, at the bottom is the research article with a problem statement. Uh, a research study will be conducted to assess the effectiveness of an interactive learning response document. That was my topic when I started in preparing teacher candidates for the teacher performance assessment. Since then, it's, uh, it has changed. Uh, we discuss things uh, which are in quantitative designs which yield uh, correlational research, developmental designs, observational studies, survey research, a lot was done. And what I learned most from this course, or an important thing which I learned, was that in fact uh, a relationship could, does not show causation. It just shows that an independent uh, variable and a dependent variable, uh, uh, there's some kind of association there. Uh, here are links to my uh, interview protocol, a personal reflection, and a precy. Uh, up here, not to forget this, words have meaning. I will always remember that for Dr. Tatum. And it prompted me to create a litany of, of misinterpretations. It's kind of fun. Feel free to link it and download it. Thank you.